Well, howdy there, Internet people. It's Bo again, and today we are going to talk about New Jersey and Senator Menendez. Yes, Gold Bar Menendez. We're going to talk about the proceedings, where they're at, and then we're going to talk about something that might occur and the political implications of it if it happens. Okay, so for those who need a quick recap, Senator Menendez uh, was accused of basically taking bribes, to keep it short. Um, this is the person when their house was searched, there were gold bars and just cash everywhere. Uh, even with that, the defense threw up a whole lot of stuff. I don't know if the jury is going to view it as reasonable doubt, but the defense did, I think, way better than anybody expected them to. Um, so, as it stands, the jury will uh, resume deliberating on Monday. Their determination is not only obviously important to the case, but if he is acquitted, he has his paperwork in to run as an independent. He, uh, he backed away from running as a Democrat again, and he may run as an independent. If that occurs, it completely alters the dynamics up there. Um, he would probably pull votes from all over the place. Uh, if that occurs, if he is acquitted, and he decides to follow through with the independent run, all bets are off. It, it would alter everything. Because there will certainly be some people within the Democratic Party who decide to vote for him. And it, it's pretty likely that he's going to pull votes from the Republican side of the aisle as well. Um, so, aside from the case, there is, there's a lot of downstream effects that people, people in New Jersey in particular should probably watch the case, watch how it plays out, because it very well may alter the, the political dynamics as far as the Senate race up there. Um, in fact, I am, I'm almost certain that if he's acquitted, he's going to follow through with that run. And if he does, it's going to be an interesting campaign season up there. Anyway, it's just a thought. Y'all have a good day.